Greetings, Sagittarius. Welcome to your reading for the time period of October 1st to the 22nd, 2018. I am using B playing cards, okay? So I'm going to run through the suits really quickly so you guys are familiarized with um, the different kinds of suits and pertaining to playing cards, okay? So we have diamonds here, which represent earth sign energies, pentacles. Then you have your spades represent air. So you're looking at swords. These are hearts. Hearts represent water sign energy, cups, energies. And the clubs or covers represent fire, okay? So I just wanted to run through those really quickly. If throughout the reading you seem to have forgotten um, the, the, um, the suits of the playing cards, feel free to rewind the video to the spot that you want to get to, okay? All righty. Let's see. Such... <sighs> Welcome new subscribers to my channel as well. Thank you for joining me. I really appreciate you and your support. All right, let's see. Oh, There's this feeling of maybe someone could be getting locked up, but I get an Aquarian, Aquarian guy, um, either they, they got locked up before or this is newfound to you and maybe you're sharing it with family members and friends. But there's also this element here where you may have asked an Aquarian energy to do something and maybe maybe there's this element of you could have been behind the scenes of protecting that energy from getting found out. But I get something about like a banging of something. So it could be like a banging, um, what do you call it? It could be like the banging of somebody head against something um or banging maybe maybe you're accusing that energy it could be sex maybe um but i get sister so maybe you could be dealing with an aquarian guy that was having sex with your sister i don't know or um or they or they had sex with someone that you call your sister it doesn't have to be um someone that's a biological sister to you but some somebody is very aggressive so it could be it doesn't have to be an aquarian guy it could be any air sign but i was being drawn to an aquarius so that's why i am dealing with that energy so heavily but there's a harping on so either there you're you could be harping on the fact that you asked that person to do something and maybe they're getting caught and they're getting locked up for it or a situation here where they, um, but I get that they, they, somebody was really, this could be like an implication of a rape or maybe like a sibling or a friend that was rough sexed, you know, and maybe there's this feeling of maybe they're running to you and they're crying and, and maybe the element that they were having sex with became really aggressive. So it's either one of those three or four situations I just picked up. So you're dealing with an Aquarian guy that um, you're trying to protect them because they did something wrong to somebody and um they're getting locked up because they did something bad and because they have been found out with this kind of energy but i do get it's because of a video so maybe it could be um it could have been a sex video it could have been like a surveillance camera of some kind somebody could have been caught you know in a tussle or a fight outside i get outside of like a um outside of a bodega you know in new york city they call corner stores bodega so someone could have been um but again, you and an aquarius like you you could have been caught outside of uh outside of a bodega or a store of some kind with an aquarian energy arguing with them or setting you know you know setting up something with them but now what's happening is is there could have there were surveillance cameras somewhere so th th what's happening is that what was kept quiet you know in terms of that kind of interaction is no longer quiet so if you were trying to do something like a business transaction with an aquarian um somebody caught it on like us or is potentially someone could catch it on our surveillance camera of some kind or if you ask that person to do something there could be sort of there could be cameras inside of a house um you know to see if somebody came into someone's room somebody came into the store you know it could be implications of burglary or robberies i'm not saying that necessarily but it feels more so you're either protecting an aquarian energy from getting caught 
because they did something bad, because you were caught having secretive business deals with them outside of a store, outside of an apartment, outside of whatever. Um, and there's this feeling and fear and feeling of getting caught with this kind of feeling. So either somebody was rough sexed, you know, Aquarian could be the perpetrator. They were roughly having sex with someone and maybe you're, you're a part of setting that up or you know of it, or your cousin was involved in Aquarian and they're your friend, whoever, somebody's running to you and like, you know, he was rough handling me. You know, it could be a police. You know, maybe there's this feeling of getting rough handled by a police, could be an Aquarian police officer. I don't feel that. I feel like the Aquarian is someone that you're doing business with and you're fearing that element getting rough handled by police or raped in jail or some type of craziness like that. I don't know. But it has something to do with exposure and something to do with the spot, um, something to do with the fact that, um, what do you call it? It has something to do with the fact that Somebody was in the wrong place at the wrong time with this kind of element, okay? But let's see. I have to do that again because I just, it just, they're very slippery cards, so I have to do that again. I'm sorry. So the Aquarius energy, they can't stop talking. And maybe that's why something is becoming crazy to you. And maybe they're talking about something or somebody else is talking about something, period. Okay, Sad, you have the Six of Cups. There's worry. So some type of worry is returning or six of hearts. I meant to say hearts, but I'll just go by um, the regular what I'm used to <laughs> because I could, I'm could. i already going to feel myself going back and forth with that. Six of cups energy. Somebody, some, I almost said somebody. Somebody may, there's a cancer that keeps returning. Either they're returning from the past or they keep returning with some type of topic. So maybe they keep bringing something up, but I get your involvement with an Aquarian man. So this energy, this water sign, they keep they keep bringing up the fact that you were involved with an Aquarian guy. But I also get a Libra. So they're bringing the fact that you were involved with a Libra and, and, a, and an Aquarian. So if you're a woman, maybe you were involved with those two elements. But there's a not sleeping with. So you maybe you're dumb sleeping with those energies or it could be water sign. Maybe this could be if you're a guy you are tied to a water sign or you're tied to a cancer, you're tied to them already as like a friend, you know, as a marital partner, etc. The Aquarian and Libra, they could have been exes. I also get an Aries, an Aquarian, a Libra, an Aries, female, those elements could be exes. But the, the, I think that they're coming back into a fold, into the fold. And that's why the Six of Cups energy is here. So you could be dating somebody new and then all of a sudden like their exes keep returning. They, they have more than one ex. It's could be like six exes that somebody had or five or five or four of them whatever but i also get that they're old friends like they could be college friends um they could have been old housemates of some kind but they keep returning but something's going on with them disturbing your marriage so so you have an aquarian that you're either doing business with or you slept with in the past and they're like returning again or it's um what you, or it's a Libra or an Aries. The, those elements, the, there's an Aries element that you already reside with, but is it tired of doing that? So maybe you're just tired of residing with an Aries for business. This, that element is also a family member. So if you're dealing with an Aries that's not um, a relationship partner, they are also someone that is a family member to you that you're also tired of. Somebody has neurotic behavior if you're dealing with an Aries. So they, men or women, those elements have neurotic behavior and maybe there's this feeling, but maybe they're, they have been trying to pin that on you, but maybe you feel like they need it with this kind of energy. It's all this six of cups energy that's returning. So you've got exes that's returning, some type of conversation that's returning from the past, but it's a Cancerian energy that keeps bringing it up or it's a Pisces energy that keeps bringing it up all the time. But it has something to do with the fact that I get someone was caught somewhere. So it has something to do with you being caught somewhere with an Aquarius, caught somewhere talking to whoever, can Cancer, but or a cancer caught you talking somewhere with an Aquarius, somebody caught you talking somewhere with someone and 
then things are happening <laughs> with the Six of Cups energy being here, okay? That was a lot of energy only because like the time period is really long. So I hope that you were able to pull out whatever you could from that situation. So you're doing business with an Aquarian or you slept with an Aquarian and a Libra from your past. You know, they're returning, they're disturbing your marriage or some type of issue is disturbing your marriage if you're married or you're dealing with Aries elements that have neurotic behavior. Maybe that's what's constantly returning because somebody can't stop drinking or, um, but they also can't stop texting you. So maybe you kind of see neurotic behavior as consistent, you know, nonstop texting, you know, that could also be another element as well. That was a lot of information. So I hope that you were able to, that was a lot for me to take in just now, honestly. Six of diamonds or six of pentacles energy. Six of Pentacles is a representation of spending time with Earth sign energies for your starting point. Um, but it is a making love to. Maybe you want to make love to an Earth sign energy. You know, making love doesn't have to be like sex of any kind. This could be making love. Like maybe you're working, you know, financially making love, you know, trying to, you know, profit off of a business that you started with an Earth sign or you're potentially hoping that you could, you know, do business with an Earth sign energy if that's the case. But I also get something about a Taurus. So maybe you work with a Taurus, you reside with a Taurus. Taurus, Taurus is your child, or Taurus is a family member of some kind, but something is aggravating or annoying about a, like a Taurus-like element, but I get sharing, so maybe you could be sharing something, or sign energies, you're sharing, could be workplaces, could be rooms, could be whatever, homes, like you're, maybe there's an element here where you're either, you're tired of sharing, or you're tired, of, you're tired of having to pay for something pertaining to this energy, but I get like doctor's notes, and um, like um, doctor's appointments and insurance cards, this, that, and the third. Maybe you feel something's going on with someone being self-sufficient with this kind of energy. And, and you know, I get something about throwing out a sun. So maybe you're trying, if you have an earth sign sun, you know, earth sign energy, it's like something's going on with you trying to throw out that energy or you want them to live on your own, some kind of feeling like that. Someone does not want to leave. So maybe it could be a relationship and maybe you don't want to leave an earth sign or they don't want to leave you. But I was getting Taurus and Capricorn strongly. If you're dealing with a Virgo, they're very distant. Maybe they're emotionally distant. That's why the Six Cups energy is there. You could be dealing with a very emotionally distant um, Virgo from your past that keeps returning. But the, the, they, if you're dealing with a Virgo, they keep returning and they're annoying you about something constantly. And it could be money that you owe them. You're like, what? What money? <laughs> you know, what money are you talking about? I don't owe you any money. So either it's a Virgo. I feel like that's a Virgo communication. If it's a Capricorn, maybe there's, you're supposed to be, I yeah, get you're finding out something about a Capricorn energy with the Six of Pentacles. Or you're working or residing with a Taurus and you have to pay for their doctor's notes and things. You live with them. You want them to live, you want them to live on your own. But I get the Aquarius energy again. So maybe the Aquarian energy is coming in between you and your relationship between a Capricorn, a Taurus. You know, if, I mean, I don't feel like an Aquarian is coming between you and um and a Virgo necessarily. I feel like that's more of the Virgo energy is more, but they're more from your distant past. If you're dealing with a Virgo like element, they're more distant. They're more deep in the past. They're only returning to annoy you about money. So they could have been an ex coworker or, or ex friend or ex housemate of something of some kind. The Taurus and the Capricorn energy, they're more current. But they're, they're like annoyances for some reason with the six of diamonds energy here. So there's a need to um, figure out how to, I guess, how to get somebody out. So you're trying to figure out how to get someone out of your home. You know, if it's a child, maybe these are your kids. If you want, you know, I, you want to spend time with a lover, but maybe there's just kids around. Six of pentacles, six of diamonds. There's kids around. The six of, the six of hearts energy. The Six of Cups energy is like maybe you got in contact with an ex. You know, you could have gotten in contact with an ex. But now what's happening is maybe you have kids, they have kids, they're, they're struggling to get their kids out of the way. But I guess something about being a step parent, maybe maybe someone that you're dating or talking to or you, you, you there's a step parent kind of vibe. And maybe there's kids, somebody's somebody's um stepchildren and children, they're always in a way with the six of diamonds and, and the six of um and the six of hearts energy here. You know, but you're trying to get somebody out of the house. But I get the Taurus. I mean, you're trying to get a Taurus like element out of the house with the six of diamonds energy here, but something that's very difficult to do for some reason. The six of the six of hearts energy is here because maybe this is something that you keep trying to do, like like from the past. Like it keeps returning all the time. Someone's going to have a depression. So maybe you think that a sign energy is depressed, or maybe you're something's going on with you with an ex returning all the time, or ex coworker, ex friend. Maybe you keep. Maybe you think that they're depressed with the six of diamonds energy here. And that's why, maybe that's why you're, maybe you feel bad. And maybe that's why you're spending time with an element, with some element there. 
But an Aquarian energy doesn't want you to do that. An Aquarian energy wants you to um, like give a Taurus-like element freedom. That an Aquarian energy wants you to give a Taurus-like element freedom. Friend, fan, friend, child, family member wants you to give it. Like something's going on with being spoiled or favoring a Taurus-like element for biz, business or love or you know friendship of some kind or housemate situation. Something's going on with you favoring that element. You know, and maybe the Aquarian is like, you know, give him and her some space, you know, vice versa, whatever it is with the six of diamonds energy here. OK, you're waiting on the eight of spades. Eight of spades represents the eight of swords. Eight of swords energy, but it's a not hearing from. So it could be earth sign, could be water sign. The water, I get something about going away from a water sign. Maybe you're trying to go away. For, I was getting cancer and Pisces. Maybe you're trying to go away from those elements. But sometimes it's very difficult to do because there's money involved. Maybe you, you share a workplace with a Cancer and a Piscean-like energy. You share a workplace with those elements, but maybe you maybe they're the ones that you're not hearing from, and maybe but they're leaving because you're not hearing from a Pisces and a Cancer. They're leaving. I get a whole workplace or a whole job environment. They're, they're leaving it up to you to to control on your own with the Eight of Swords energy. Maybe you're you're confused. I get you're leave, you're constantly calling someone. You're constantly you know calling and, and having to leave voicemails and voice messages. But you're like, where am I gonna get the money from to do this? Maybe maybe it's a trip. Maybe it's something. Um, maybe it's something pertaining to somebody's constantly taking leave off of work all the time. So maybe it's a cancer with the six of cups. Maybe it's a cancer, but they're not wanting to be found out. So maybe a cancerian energy that you work with or your house with, you sleep with, whatever, or they're a family member. That element. Like they, they, they're not wanting to be heard from with the eight of swords energy. Maybe you think that someone did, did something bad if they're a cancer, you know, maybe you feel the cancer and energy did something bad, but I keep being drawn to an Aquarian. But I guess there's a three-way partnership between you and the Cancer and Aquarian energy as, as well. Something is going on by Aries, the Aries element as well with the eight of swords. But I get all these people are involved with getting somebody out. So it could be the Taurus or the Capricorn. And something that's not working. If you, an Aquarius, a Cancer, what was the other sign I just got? Pisces, I don't feel like that. You and a Cancer, an Aquarius, an Aries, trying to get Earth sign energies out of the house, out of, out of the way. You're, you're trying to get those elements out of the way. Mm, six of Cups, Six of Hearts energy here with the Eight of Swords. But she's not going to stop doing it with the Eight of Swords. And maybe it's the kind of work that someone does. Remember, maybe it's ticking off of, maybe somebody keeps, maybe earth sign energy, they, they keep, there's absence. Maybe they're constantly absent for some reason or or they're not showing up to class. It could be school. Maybe someone's not showing up to school with the eight of swords and maybe you're calling and you're trying to figure out where somebody went. But I get some, somebody got picked up. So if it's an earth sign energy, you know, or cancer or Pisces, I just, I don't feel that. I feel like it's earth sign energies. Like this, this is element here where people are you or whatever, you're a part of some type of clan of people trying to get earth sign energies out of the way. But something's going on where somebody or somebody's they didn't show up to like a workplace or a job or a school anyway with the six of pentacles. You're like, where are they with the eight of swords? You're trying to figure out where somebody went or, um, but, but you're trying, there's a pickup. Maybe somebody got picked up in an Uber or a cab, but you're trying to figure out where somebody got the money to even get in an Uber or a cab with the eight of swords. But I gave it to her. Maybe you or gave it to him. You you gave her sign energy, but I get cancer. You gave a Cancerian energy and possibly even her sign energies, uh, Capricorn and Taurus or Virgo, whatever. You gave those four energies. You 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 help. I you help you. When I said four energies, you help those elements out financially with the six of diamonds energy here. You help them out financially, but you're tired of doing that with the eight of swords. But somebody got somebody got into an Uber. Somebody got into a cab. But I get without your, I guess someone like getting into a cab or Uber without permission with the Eight of Swords energy here. Somebody got into a cab or something without permission, whatever that means. Without permission could be it feels like kids, like maybe it's teenage stuff. We have teenagers, you know. Maybe maybe you could have given somebody money to to to, to spend on a specific situation, but they used it to to for their own benefit to get into cabs and like shopping to go shopping with with the Six of Diamonds. Hmm. Somebody could have went, but some, somebody cannot be found with the eight of swords. So somebody could have gone into a cab or Uber, can't be found. Where does she go? Where did he go? But yeah, the Taurus, the, 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 the Taurus kind of element, maybe the Capricorn, but yeah, together, maybe, maybe I said those two elements, they're together and maybe that's what's going on. Maybe they're, maybe they went somewhere together. 
and you think they went somewhere together, but I get fearing that. Maybe maybe you're fit, maybe, oh, I see, I see what's going on. You may you may reside with a Capricorn or a Taurus like element for business, or this element could be in the workplace with you. But I get a Pisces knows a Pisces may have information. Maybe those two elements, the Capricorn and the Taurus, they could have gotten into like a car. They could have gotten into a car. I remember you think that, you know, with the Eight of Swords, but he or she's not picking up the phone. Maybe you feel like somebody's disappearing on purpose. So maybe somebody's trying to get away from you on purpose or maybe there's a feeling of setting that up also. So maybe maybe there's this element here where someone could have disappeared or they involuntarily or voluntarily or, but there's something that's going on. I get cheating. Somebody, maybe you feel like somebody's cheating with the six of coins, with the six of, of diamonds energy here on the eight of swords. You feel like someone is is cheating with this element being here and you're disappearing on purpose, but you, you're you giving them, you're dishing out money. You're giving them money, but you, there's something's going on with them hanging out with someone that you don't want them to hang out with, with the eight of swords, but to track her down, track him down, eight of swords energy. I don't want him. I don't want him with her. I don't want her with him. Eight of Swords. There's nosiness with that also. When you're going online, I always kind of look at sword-like elements as going online and being nosy and trying to track down someone. But right? son, you're trying to track down your son. Mm, your son is with someone that you don't. But that your son is with someone that you don't want them with. If you got a son. Or this is your boy. Maybe maybe the Taurus like or the Capricorn or whatever. Maybe those are friends. Maybe that element is your friend. And maybe they're hanging. I get your woman. I mean, your friend is hanging out with your woman with the with the six of coins and the eight of swords. That's why it's the eight of swords energy here. Oh, that's why they. I mean, this is crazy. <laughs> this is this is really out of control. So you're finding out that your your partner is dating a housemate. You're you're finding out your partner is dating your housemate, or your girl, your guy is messing with is messing. Your girl, your guy is messing with your friend with the eight of swords and the six of diamonds. Hmm. Wow, how to track them down with the Eight of Swords. So either someone is, maybe it's right, either it's voluntary or it's, or it's involuntary with this Six of Hearts energy here. He's returning from the past. But I get cancer. Every time I say returning from the past, I get cancer nose. There's a cancer somewhere that I get they saw. There's a cancer energy that saw something happen. Maybe, maybe they saw someone get into a car with someone. But again, they started driving really fast. Somebody saw someone get into the car and then they started driving really fast with the Eight of Swords. They started driving really fast. So they could be the Capricorn and the Taurus together or Capricorn by themselves or Taurus by themselves. Maybe somebody's driving off in a car really quickly so, I, so you won't see where they're going. Like somebody's getting in a car really quickly, by right? Cancer. Cancer's getting in the car really quickly so you won't see where they're going, Eight of Swords. Hmm. And when I say cancer, I get Pisces nose. <laughs> this is like, it's like a chain reaction. Like there's a, there's a cancer getting into a car. They're not telling you where they're going, but a Pisces has information into that. Then there's a Taurus and a Capricorn getting into a car together or they're getting, the car, getting in the car individually by themselves. And, 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 and a cancer has information for, and, and a cancer has information of that as well with the eight of swords energy. Wow. Oh, the eight of diamonds energy here. Eight of diamonds. You're work. I get truth. You maybe you're working hard to uh, find out the truth about a situation. I get where your wife went. Where your wife went with well, your wife, your woman, your friend. You know, I don't feel like there's a friend I was getting wife. So if you're a dude, this wife. You know, or maybe, or maybe this is somebody's wife that is they're missing. Somebody's wife is missing with the eight of diamonds, eight of AKA eight of pentacles energy here. Somebody's wife is missing. Mm, somebody's wife, your wife is missing. But as I know if your wife, if you're a man and your wife is missing, this is intuitive feeling where you know you know where somebody is. But right? with a Pisces, you you know a cancer, you know a cancer is with a Pisces. But right? the Capricorn, maybe the Capricorn and the Taurus like elements, you did, like, something about them being together, and maybe that's maybe that's you're you're either fearing that or you know that or, or you don't know that. And the Cancer has information, Eight of Pentacles. There's this element here where you, I get a neighbor. Maybe you, maybe you asked, you could have asked a neighbor to, to what I get your, you may have asked a neighbor to watch your son or watch your housemate or your wife, your girlfriend, your boyfriend, whatever. You, you may have asked a neighbor to stalk someone. You, you may have asked a neighbor to go follow someone, go watch someone or watch somebody's moves with the eight of diamonds energy here. Mm, somebody feels betrayed or sign energy feel betrayed by that with the, with the eight of diamonds. Mm, I guess that's why someone that could also be with a reason the reason into why someone wants to move as well or why you want someone to move because there's a there's a stalking act you'd say about it online somebody is being stalked online with the eight of swords 
Mm. But again, it's for whatever the whatever the stalking is for a good reason with the eight of swords energy. Mm. Somebody wants to unfollow you, or you want to unfollow someone with the eight of swords. I don't feel like you want to unfollow someone. I feel like somebody wants to unfollow you because you're nosiness. Like you're, you're being nosy about something, right? Like Taurus. Maybe you're maybe you're being nosy with a Taurus and I get fake accounts. Maybe you made up fake accounts to go follow a Taurus like element, but something's going on with their account being private with the eight of diamonds energy here. Their account is private. If you're dealing with a Taurus, their account is private. Mm, wow. But it's a, why does she stop talking to me? So it could be the earth sign. She's, why did she's a cancer? I always get the cancer. Why is a cancer not talking to you? That could be the cheating situation. It could be, or it's a Taurus. Or the she could be a Taurus. She could be the Capricorn or sign energy, Virgo energy. I don't feel Virgo heavily. I feel more like a Taurus, Capricorn. I feel like a Taurus is more like a male energy. Capricorn, maybe the female. But is this element here, you're dealing with a female Taurus. It could be a guy also. Maybe maybe it's a female cancer that's not talking to you. But you don't care. If a cancerian man isn't talking to you, you don't care. Maybe because that element owes maybe because that element I owes you money. I get from a long time. There's a cancerian man that owes you money from a long time ago. Some water sign that with the eight of pentacles energy. But you're working hard to get over that. Maybe it doesn't matter with the eight of swords energy. Mm, very interesting. <sighs> Your future has the eight of hearts energy. Eight of hearts. Eight of hearts. Something is uncomfortable to you. But it helps. Maybe something is something is very uncomfortable about a house environment. So either somebody is missing. But get the Taurus and the Cap the Taurus and the Capricorn energy. That they, they, they're missing or they're together somewhere. They're missing out of a workplace, out of a home, and maybe that's why it's uncomfortable with the Eight of Hearts energy here. There's a private investigation going on also with the. But I get, when I said private investigation, I get Aquarius. I get pointing finger at you. You're pointing fingers at an Aquarian energy with the Eight of Hearts energy here. But I get that they're the, the Aquarian energy is the reason into why someone is missing as well with these with the Eight of Spades. They're they're the reason that they're not talking. It was an Aquarian that they're not talking. I get something that they saw. An Aquarian energy saw something happen somewhere. But I get like in front of somewhere, like in front of a house, a store, a shop, a street. They saw. I get jump. Somebody was jumped or like jumped. Like somebody may have been jumped or they were involved in a fight. And it could be the Aquarius. I feel like an Aquarius is like a is like an onlooker or somehow they saw that happen with the Eight of Swords. But you're trying to understand why this could be a situation where somebody somebody saw something happen like like right outside like like but they they saw but they they're, they're being mousy and they're not talking and it's an aquarian energy and they're not someone's aggravating about that to you because they're not talking they're not talking eight of cups with the eight of the the eight of 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 hearts with the eight of spades they're not talking maybe you feel like you want to bribe someone to talk <laughs> like there's this element of having to bribe someone to i get a taurus uh, maybe you feel like you want to bribe a taurus to talk or an aquarian energy to talk mm, maybe something about a libra maybe a libra is is involved as well but get behind the scenes a, a, a libra is behind the scenes of something that's going on maybe in a school environment so maybe maybe this is a student that is missing or maybe that's why I said somebody didn't return to class. Like maybe a student is missing. Maybe a student is missing and in Libra and in Aquarius energy, they know. Maybe a fight. When I said Libra and Aquarius, get fight. Maybe they're fighting or maybe you're finding out that those elements were fighting. But there's something going on. Like that's the reason into why somebody disappeared with the Eight of Swords energy, the Eight of uh, Spades. Somebody, dis somebody, okay, somebody, you could have been, you could have, a Capricorn, you could have gotten into a fight or a verbal argument of some kind in a business love or sex, whatever it is, you, you could have gotten into a fight or some type of verbal altercation with a Capricorn or some earth sign energy, but they, I get shown up on the news. When I said earth sign energy, I get showing up on the news, they're, they're showing up on the news because you got into a tussle or a verbal argument with them. So what's happening is that they, they're disappearing and it's like Libra and Aquarian energy. They saw something happen or they saw, that's why I said car, getting the cars and, and I get a chauffeur. Maybe, maybe somebody is like, um, what do you call, that's why I said the stalking online, the stalking energy. Maybe somebody may have gotten invited to go to a really fancy situation where the, the, there's a chauffeur with the eight of swords, or maybe you work somewhere where there's a chauffeur. But when I said work somewhere with a chauffeur, I get Aries. Maybe I get shown up. Maybe an Aries is shown up to somewhere where you work where where there's where there's a chauffeur. 
But I get, I've been buying her dinner and lunch and this, that, and third. Maybe it's an Aries female that you've been buying dinner and lunch for. But I get Capricorn energy knows that. Maybe maybe a Capricorn energy knows that already with the with the Eight of Diamonds. Some, something that you're trying to conceal around the Capricorn energy is not working with the Eight of Diamonds. Somebody already knows things with the Eight of Swords and the Eight of Diamonds energy here. But when I say Eight of Swords and Eight of Diamonds, get leave my house. You're working hard to get someone to leave your house. Bad communication because it's 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 something that you're trying to. Okay, I see what's going on. You you somebody as some revealing. Maybe somebody's revealing something inside of your house, and maybe that's why you want them to leave. Maybe it stole. Maybe somebody stole something inside. Or maybe you're trying to. Maybe you're trying to blame. Maybe you're trying to say somebody stole something inside of your house. Maybe that's true. It's not true. Maybe some of the Taurus, maybe a Taurus element. Some, some, when I said Taurus, I get on purpose. Maybe a Taurus did something on purpose. Or you asked a Taurus to do something on purpose to get somebody to leave somewhere, a home or a workplace or a school or classroom situation by saying that someone was, I guess something that something that somebody wrote, like, um, what do you call it? Like a paper or like a, um, oh, it could be paper, it could be documents, it could be really a birth certificate of some kind. It could be coursework of some kind, eight of swords. Mm. But you ask a Taurus, you if whatever it is, maybe you just want to see something that somebody wrote. I mean, you, I don't know. For some reason, you just want to see something, but it's looking like a stealing situation with the Eight of Swords. It's looking like a stealing situation. It could be male. I get some. There's some type of weird energy with the like somebody doesn't want their last name to be seen. I know that's kind of crazy to say. Somebody doesn't want, I get Aries. Uh, Aries does not want their last name to be seen. Or they don't want, I get the Capricorn. They don't want a Capricorn energy to, to see that their mail, like the mail that is being delivered somewhere. Somebody doesn't, that's strange. That's really weird. Like somebody doesn't want their last name to be seen. But I get something about like um like the census, like uh what do you call it? Um like the like the governmental census and you know document social security and documented. Maybe it could it's something's going on where that could be pulled up and oh I see what's going on. The Aries element is resp I get disappearance. Aries is, is responsible for the disappearance of a cu I got a cousin. Aries is responsible for the disappearance of a cousin. But the, there somebody doesn't care also that someone has disappeared, but it could be the earth sign energy. But what's going on here is that somebody, somebody, they, they don't want, that they're responsible, so they don't want their identity out there. But what's happening is that there's some type of tech, crazy technology that allows someone to track down somebody's last name with the Eight of Swords. So you could be doing that on an Earth sign, or it's happening to an Earth sign, or or it's because of that, the reason it's why somebody's always, somebody's tired of deceiving things happen, or happening around them. It could be the Earth sign energies, you know? But you're using information, like you're, you're using Earth sign energies information. They're tired of the, of the lying and, de and deceptive energy, but it can't be. The cancer is also tired of that as well. So either you either a cancer knows that you're doing that to an earth sign or you're doing that to a cancer and they're, they're aggravated, but they don't want you around because of that with the eight of swords energy. But so why are we doing this? Like you're, you're trying, there's something going on. The universe is asking, why are we, why are you guys doing this? Why, why are we doing this with the eight of swords? Why are we doing this? So this, all this deceptive, deceptive so who, okay. Whoever is being deceived, Capricorn, Taurus, cancer, whatever. Those elements, like whoever is being deceived, can't take the deception anymore. So they're disappearing. They're disappearing, right? They're disappearing, and and is a you're trying to track them. They don't want it. somebody doesn't want to be found by you at all. Like right? family member, your family member does not want to be found by you. They don't want it, your wife, your husband, your 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 lover, your 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 housemate. Somebody doesn't want to be found. Like, when I say housemate, I get Taurus. Maybe a Taurus is doing this. If somebody doesn't want to be found by you. They feel deceived or side energies. They feel they feel deceived. Yeah, that's why you're giving back time and money to them because they feel deceived with the eight of 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 of, of spades here. Then you're dealing with a neurotic Aries that they they, they, they don't want that back. They're, somebody is background checking them, but I get the Pisces. Uh, Pisces is background checking uh, Aries element, and that's why they're they're losing their mind about about their last name. Somebody you seeing their last name with the eight of spades. Mm, so I said census and governmental information, social security, like somebody could find that out anyway. <laughs> Some, what the hell is the point <laughs> with the eight of spades? The hell is the point? Mm, the hell is the point? Or you're trying to figure out where somebody went or they got locked up somewhere. I don't know. An Aquarian, it's something stupid about an Aquarian energy. And you feel like they're stupid for them. So doing something, conceal it or not saying something, seeing something. 
your involvement with them, they are clowns. Like, there's an Aries and Aquarius. Like, something's going on with them being clowns. Like, something is clown-like about them. Maybe they're making stupid moves. Maybe something is stupid. Maybe so, something is sloppy. And, 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 and something is sloppy about something that they're doing. It could be business deals. Like, maybe you're doing the business deals with an Aquarian energy. You know, but they're doing it sloppily, and the, the, there's somebody. Some oh, I see. That's why because I because they're leaving mail in places. Like maybe they're leaving. Oh, I see what's going on. Somebody doesn't want like their whole name seen, or they don't want. Maybe it's you. You somebody is or the Aquarian. I don't know. Somebody somebody doesn't want or the Aries. The those they get idiots. When I when I said I get idiots, like there's something that's idiotic about them. That like, they don't want. They don't want their last names and things seen in places, but there's a way that that could be done anyway. So what's the point of hiding it? And the Pisces is doing secret and background checks on that. Mm, but when I said when I said Pisces and secret and background checks, I get your exes, somebody's exes, or ex business partners. They they want that wanted to back out of something. Like there's there's ex business partners that you have. Or had that that they're trying to back out of something, but hey, Cancer told you to do that. Maybe a Cancerian energy told you to do that. They told you to do that. Jesus Christ! <laughs> oh my God! So this could be business where you're trying to work with Earth sign, but but people people are the people are annoyed by the fact that you want to do that or you don't. But the Earth sign energy can't take the deception, so they're disappearing. But there's something going on, but they maybe they're disappearing, and there's a serious fear into and uh, locked up. There's a serious fear that maybe somebody got locked up, or you getting locked up, or some Aquarian Aquarian energy getting locked up, and they're losing their mind. Aries and Aquarian because they don't want their information on blast somewhere. They don't want their information on blast somewhere in a workplace, in a in whatever a house that could be stealing information in the house. Mm, but that there's no point in hiding things because some somebody has like somebody has family members with secret hookups like the, somebody has family members that are making like secretive background checks on their housemates and they don't even know that but yeah, the Capricorn maybe the Capricorn energy has family members that are doing secretive background checks on 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 their housemates on on people that work with them. Or maybe, maybe you ask, maybe you're working with a Pisces to do this with an earth sign. I don't feel that. I feel that it's happening to you or it's happening to Aquarius, Aries element. That's why somebody's freaking out about male being seen somewhere. There's no point. Somebody already has a hookup. But again, the Capricorn energy did, didn't even ask for someone again, to protect them. They, they didn't even ask someone to protect them. Maybe the Taurus, maybe the Taurus is protecting the Capricorn. And that's maybe why they're disappearing together or or the the Taurus is protecting the or some earth sign energy they're protected by by their by their family. Their family is protecting them. But I also get that's why their family isn't talking to them as well. These elements could be your family or it's external and it's it's, it's your wife's family isn't talking. And maybe something's going on with you being sketchy and your and your wife's family doing these things. Maybe your friend, maybe your maybe your wife's or your girlfriend's family is is doing stupid background checks on you. And you didn't know that, or or you're a woman, or you're a woman. I, I, these elements are ex coworkers. I get that you're finding out that these you're, you're if you're a woman, these are sign energies. Maybe they're ex coworkers that you're finding out that your business partners were involved with stealing information from them. Oh my God, Eight of Swords. Jesus Christ, people are crazy. <laughs> the Eight of Clubs energy here. Travel for your accomplishment. But I get to get away. Maybe you're trying to get away from so it's fire-like elements. So maybe you're trying to get away from I get Aries. You're trying to get away from an Aries. They have low self-esteem. If you're dealing with an Aries, their self-esteem is very low for some reason. But get, it, they're, because their self-esteem is low, that's why they're stealing. Like maybe, maybe you don't see something's going on. Like they're stealing things, but but that is that is a low self-esteem move. Maybe something's going on with you stealing stuff. But it's a low stuff. That's whatever somebody's stealing. But it's a low self esteem. So that's why I said papers and copies and this that and third and writing. This could be coursework that somebody's doing. Make it happening to the Capricorn. Like somebody's trying to do this to. A, there's jealousy with the Capricorn energy and in the school and in a home and a wherever, in a job and and somebody's like somebody's trying to claim somebody's work coursework for 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 their own. Some type of writing. Like it could be like online. It could be like um. It could be like a post online, a really good, really well written paper, really whatever it is. It wants. Gee, somebody's gonna get caught. 
way the Aquarius is. An Aquarian is going to get caught because they're involved with that. They're, something, something. an Aquarian is, is external from any kind of school situation or job. Situ they're more like home or family or whatever. But they, I get involved, when I say home and family, I get involved since birth. There's an Aquarian that has been involved with something going on here since some since birth. Since some type of birth situation, like maybe like the many if many and you're finding out an aquarium was involved with something pertaining to you since birth. Mm, maybe this has to do with a neighborhood situation or or maybe something's going on with secrecy and with secrecy with, with with where you grew up or where somebody secrecy with where somebody grew up or secrecy with with family members and and friends and, and hookups and people being involved. I get we are private affairs or this element is or sign energy private affairs. Or the papers or the schoolwork, then where they grew up, census, governmental things, eight of wands. Mm. But I don't want her to find out. So, or sign, Capricorn, Cancer, whoever she is, could be a Pisces female, whatever. All of them, <laughs> Virgo, whatever. You don't want these, or sign, Cancer, whatever. You don't want them to find out something, but it's not working. It's not working. Or they don't want you to find out something that is not working. But it's a how to hide. Like I'm looking at the eight of spades. You're like, how to hide from someone? How to hide from somebody? Just, that's why I said you're trying to get away from the areas. You, you don't understand that like, you're trying to get away from them. But I get the, they're trying to make you do things that, that you don't, on earth sign energy, you don't want to do. But hey, the Taurus is manipulated. When I said the Aries is trying to get you to do something, like the Taurus element is manipulated. Like the, the, something's going on with them being manipulated into doing something or also concealing something, pretending to the disappearance of a person or somebody's information or mail or papers or whatever it is, coursework, and it wants. Hmm. Maybe you don't want somebody to find out that you're, you're, you're more involved with their personal affairs and life than, than they think or that they're aware of with the, with the six, with the six of diamonds and the eight of spades. But this, I don't want her to know I know her father or sister or mom or dad. It's going to be someone that you're dating or maybe it's the Aries or you're involved with the Aries parents, some, some fire sign that you know, Leo, maybe you're involved, maybe something's going on with you in a Leo like element. But yeah, that's the parent. Like, uh, there's somebody had a Leo that was a parent, but maybe for some reason, like you know, like you edit Capricorn, you know the Capricorn's parents somehow, or you know of their parents, or you know more information. I, you, you have information into how somebody's parents pass, or you, you have more detail into that, or you were part of that for some reason with the eight of, of spades. But when I say eight of spades, get all this truth is coming out. Like all this crazy truth is coming out with the eight of spades. So this could be an element. This could be an element here with um I get the, the secretive passing of somebody's parents. Like either you have info. This could be like you're dating somebody. This could be like you're married or dating somebody, but somehow, like somehow, you 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 <laughs> you you have like secretive information on how their parents passed, that their parents have passed. Or they have secretive information on how your parents pass, or how one of your parents pass, or both of them are gone, or 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 not, or grandparents, or a sibling, or something like that. If you have both of your parents, maybe it's just an external situation. Maybe it's just external. Mm, but whatever it is, like somebody has maybe maybe you have secretive information on how somebody's parent passed, or your parent, or your, your girlfriend, your boyfriend, your husband, wife. Somebody has secretive information on how somebody's parents passed, but they're not saying anything with the eight of swords. But it, the Aquarian, it, it, someone going on with a hospital and an Aquarian energy. Mm, somebody knows how somebody's parents passed, or they were part of it, or they, it's crazy. Something's crazy about setting up something like that with the eight of, of spades. There's a lockup kind of energy with the eight of spades. Wow. But a Taurus told, maybe a Taurus told you something about somebody's parents. Maybe a Taurus. I get secretive. Somebody was doing like um secretive. That's why I said background checks and this, that, and the third. Like, I get that that's why as a Capricorn, maybe somebody doesn't, somebody doesn't want somebody searching up their personal things, but somehow that's why I said finding out anyway. Like maybe a Taurus, somebody did like secretive like background information into someone. I get the Aquarius, and Aquarius energy did that. Maybe a Taurus element did that together, like an Aquarian and a Taurus did that. They dug up somebody's personal information somehow with the six of diamonds and the eight of spades. But like you told them to. Maybe okay, this could be a situation where that's why I said the technology. 
somebody has some type of specialized technology somewhere inside of their house where they just have that somewhere they go and they travel somewhere to go get it done whatever they somebody has some type of special technology that they go do background checks on someone any any which way how mm. Maybe there's maybe there's this element here where there's there's some type of back chat that's happening. Like either you're doing it to an earth sign. But maybe maybe some, something that's why I said from the other reading, something that maybe your your conversations with someone, like maybe maybe you're maybe oh, something's going on with you, like um like in encrypted messages in a conversation. Like maybe you're maybe you're having like very like um you're you're saying cryptic things to someone within a conversation, but you, you're trying to give them like um psychic hints or intuitive hints into into you trying to let them know that hey I know more about your life. Maybe that's what you're trying to do. Somebody knows that already, but they're not saying anything. Maybe you're trying to bring that out for some reason, for whatever reason. Maybe you're trying to bring that out of someone. Hmm. Very interesting. <sighs> your accomplishment has the five of cups energy, five of hearts, right next to the um the six of diamonds. But I shouldn't have told him or her. When you said something to someone that was really out there, you could have said something to someone that was really out there. Could be the earth sign energies. You you may have said something to, right, weird. You 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 said that's why I said in, in cryptic messages and in, in, in hidden saying secret things within a conversation. You're trying to act like you don't know someone, but you know more about them, whatever. You you said something weird to an earth sign. You said something weird to an earth sign. So what's happening is that there, someone's going with using it against you. So maybe you're using something. That's why I said knowing more information about them or like their health status. Like you're, you're trying to say cryptic things to someone, but you, you think that they don't know about their health. You think that they don't know about their health status, but they know about their health status, but you're trying to be cryptic with them. You're trying to make it like, seem like it's, a, it's cryptic. Like it's cryptic. This is a situation here where like, for example, you're in a workplace and you got a coworker that maybe maybe they're ill or or you're you know why they're ill with this kind you know why somebody's ill right you know why somebody's ill with this kind of energy so what's happening is is that maybe maybe you, maybe you think that they don't know why they're ill with this kind of feeling you know maybe you think that they don't know why maybe you think that they don't know why they're ill but you're 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 having conversations with them and, and it's and it's cryptic but they already they, they already know what you're trying to do. They already know what you're trying to do. Eight of eight of spades. But I shouldn't have watched. Maybe you watch something with the eight of spades. You could have watched something, right? Fear. Now, now you watch something and now you're fearing somebody. Maybe you're fearing somebody now. Something's scary. Like something's really scary about some something I found out. Maybe something's something's going on with you being scared and and, and about of, of someone. You're being scared for some reason. Cause you you know secret stuff. I get somebody's parents. So you know secretive things surrounding somebody's parents with well, the eight of eight of spades, or maybe somebody knows secretive secretive things surrounding your parents. But it's a cancer. Maybe a cancer is aware of some secretive surrounding your parents. Somebody's intuitive. It's a cancer. Somebody is intuitive. And maybe something's going on with them being like somebody is clairvoyant and intuitive around you, and it's like you're you're trying to be cryptic and snarky with them, but they already know, and maybe that's what's scaring you, or there's a situation in the workplace or home or whatever. And then there's this other element here where your partner, your wife, your husband, your coworker, whatever, somebody, somebody somehow like that. So your friend group, they they have secretive or they were part of secretive planning and the like planned demise on somebody's parents, or they know how somebody's parents died but not saying anything. They choke. Somebody's parent choked on something. Like, like someone's going on with a parent choking on something. It may already happen in the past. I mean, I mean, I don't know. Like, you let me know. Like, something that may have, somebody may have, that, that, that's how they really died. Like, okay, I see what's going on. Somebody, oh, Lord have mercy. Somebody's parent or coworker or friend or something like that, they, oh, my God. Like, they could have been, like, they could have went to the hospital and were diagnosed with something completely different than what they were, the news was telling them. That's why I said news. But somebody really choked on something. Maybe they were given something that made them choke. I don't know. They could have been given something that made them choke. A parent, a coworker, a friend, housemate. But something is to get rid of somebody faster with the eight of spades. Somebody could have ended up in a hospital because of an illness, whatever it is, but they were they were forced to take some, you're not forced to take anything, but they, they were forced to take or swallow something. 
You're forced to take or swallow something with the eight of spades. Mm, could be medicine. Wait for the heart. Someone was given medicine for the heart or some type of treatment for the heart. But it it, it made them choke. Like it's, it's, it's making them choke because maybe it's the wrong medicine on purpose. I'm not gonna tell, I'm not gonna diagnose anybody, but or a parent or whatever, but this is a situation here where um, you know, I'm just gonna give the I'm just gonna put it out there like holistic care is really important for elderly people, parents, and be careful with shady hospital workers. But when I said shady hospital workers, I get the Aries. Maybe an Aries element is a shady hospital worker. They're a shady nurse. They're they're shady, they're doing evil things to somebody. But it's sacrificial in nature with the eight of spades. Uh, this is crazy. Like, this is like somebody, uh, somebody's parents, they, they, somebody could be bedridden in a hospital, but maybe they don't even need to be in the hospital for that long. Maybe your wife's parents, your, your girlfriend's parents, your parents, and you're confused. Like, why does my mom need to be in the hospital for that long? There's an investigation when I said that. Mom in the hospital. You're investigating deeper into it with the eight of spades. Huh. Maybe a Taurus element is helping you with that. Or sun energies, they're helping you with that. They're helping you with that. Wow. Oh, your spiritual self has the five of spades. Five of spades next to the eight of spades. Hmm. But I should have let her know. Maybe it's the air sign element or sign element, Capricorn, Cancer. I should have let her know that I know more about her parents. I know more about her. That's why I said you, it's somebody's illnesses. Or their parents, somebody's parents' illnesses, or or why somebody disappeared, or why whatever it is, why somebody is gone, or they they, they dipped out with a Taurus, like somebody dipped out with a Taurus-like element. That's why the five of of that's why the five of hearts is next to the six of diamonds. Somebody's parent, somebody somebody dipped out on purpose because they were tired of being betrayed by people in a school. In a workplace, in a, in a personal relationship, at a, I guess I'm at a wedding. Maybe somebody dipped out because of a wedding. You could have dipped out because of a wedding. Hmm. Maybe talking about Aries when I said a wedding. Maybe maybe an Aries is a part of a wedding planning process, or maybe you're getting you got married to one, or you whatever. You you but you're, there was an element you trying to get away from the Aries. Some fire sign. Hmm. Somebody's getting married, and that's why the five of spades and eight of spades is here. Hmm. That's why somebody. That's why I said chauffeurs and and disappearing. Maybe your ex did that. You know, maybe maybe something's going on with an ex. Maybe you're trying to spend time with an ex, but they somebody's not telling you that they're married. But they're trying to act like they're not married. Somebody's not wearing their ring or something. With the eight of spades and five of spades, somebody's not wearing their ring, and, and you're you're traveling to your ex's place. Your friend, somebody's place. You're thinking that you're gonna get laid. Like <laughs> you're thinking that you're gonna have sex with somebody. And they're like, I'm married. With the with the five with the five of um what the hell you call it? With the five of hearts next to the six of, of diamonds. You're thinking you're in lit late. And somebody's like, I'm married, dude. Not married, man. Your mentality has the five of diamonds. Five of diamonds here. I get life support. Somebody is on like I get a Taurus. So the Taurus is on life support? Something's wrong with a Taurus being on life support? But I said when I said Taurus being on life support, I get what happened. It's some earth sign. Like you're you're trying to figure out what happened to somebody. Why why are they I get Aries? Like Aries, something's going on with the Aries and shadiness somewhere with a five with the five of um uh, with the five of, of diamonds here. Why is somebody on life support? Somebody could be if somebody's on life support, they're in a coma. They're in a coma. And when I said in a coma, I Aquarian knows. And Aquarian knows why, or some or sign energy, that they know why they're in a coma. Somebody knows why someone is in a comatic state. A parent, a housemate, a, a, a classmate, somebody that works in a school, or you go to class with somebody and you're trying to understand why someone is it, or it's an ex coworker, or ex friend that you're finding out got married. You think you're gonna get laid, some type of situation like that. You reconnecting with them, or you're trying to reconnect with them at the wrong time, and and they're like in a coma. But yeah, that's why she left the workplace. Like when I said coma, that somebody left the workplace, but somebody also tripped over something as well. That's why they're in a coma. But somebody left the workplace because they're in a coma, and we didn't know that. So I said, why wouldn't they tell me that? Why wouldn't they tell me that? 
something that's corrupt ish about some somebody in a workplace and then and you find out they are in a school or whatever and some job that you find out that they're in a coma and that's why they're not returning to work but that some of the shady and corrupt ish about a workplace or school or some job or whatever housemate situation and, and someone isn't saying why why someone is not somewhere and they're trying to make up things into why because they have more information into really what happened to somebody or somebody's parents that's why they're not returning to work or home five of clubs energy here five of clubs they ain't fighting with a sag you may be fighting with another sagittarius energy you're fighting with another sag we get dominating maybe another sag is dom trying to dominate you on this side is trying to dominate you. But it's a why your wife, like, like someone's going on, why, why your, somebody could be like, why your wife, like maybe somebody passed or somebody disappeared or something crazy like that. Or why your wife or why your friend or why your boyfriend, why? That's why it's a cheating situation. Or I, if it's not why, maybe it's where. Maybe you're arguing with someone trying to figure out where someone is. That's why I said, or assigned energies, they're missing or they're not showing up somewhere. Or showing up on the news. Hmm. Like she, when I said showing up on the news with her sign, I get she was dragged. Someone was dragged. I don't know. Like maybe somebody does drag race stuff. Maybe someone, that's why show, chauffeurs, and maybe somebody got invited to go to like a drag race show, like a drag show. I don't feel that. I just feel someone may have been dragged. Maybe someone was dragged. Five of, five of clubs. Someone was dra dragging doesn't have to be like literal literally dragging maybe like um what do you call it dragged someone was being dragged along like just like dragged along in a relationship like someone was being dragged along and metaphorically in a relation in a relationship mm, someone's being dragged in a relationship with the five of with the five of clubs hmm being used five of clubs energy they're just being used you know that's why you're arguing with a sad hey, aries you're arguing with a sad and aries about that somebody just being used somewhere you're working hard to to, to uh, 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 you're working hard to ask what is wrong with somebody as well with the five of clubs what is wrong with somebody I means something's wrong with the fire signs you're arguing with a sad what's wrong with them because because they saw something they set up something they, they're a part of something stealing information whatever it is what's wrong with them five of five was clubs in a school a workplace and family in a home situation not knowing knowing more about somebody's parents why somebody's ill somebody's parents were set up in a hospital or they were whatever it is five of clubs somebody saw some somebody get into a car they were dragged into a car or some type of craziness like that with the five of clubs Wow. But I should have never let her live here. So let me something happened with the fact that somebody moved moved to live somewhere with the five of clubs. Hmm. Something's crazy is going on. Six of six of um oh, I'm tired. Six of cups, six of hearts, and I mean not six, I'm sorry. Nine of um nine of hearts with the eight of hearts. I mean, you're wishing something was different about a home environment. Something crazy is going on in a home environment. You're wishing that something was different. We get mystical. Maybe maybe somebody's mystical. Somebody may be mystical somewhere in a job or a home or a school. And maybe it's, it's something, something about that is causing problems. But I get people or somebody's taking something too seriously as well with the with the with the eight of spades and eight of uh, with eight and five of spades. Somebody's taking something too seriously. I get online like somebody's taking something too seriously online or in a house, whatever it is. Somebody's taking it really seriously, like to the head. So this could be a situation where you find your ex got married. That's why I said chauffeurs and weddings and this that. You could be, but they don't. I get, they don't want you like this. You mean you think an ex wants you, and they don't. To be the air sign energies or Aries, you're trying to get away from them because some is sadistic. Something is sadistic about an Aries, or neurotic and sadistic about an Aries. That's you're trying to get away. Mm. But you're arguing with them. You're arguing with these fire sign energies, and hey, because they need help. Like you're arguing with other fire signs because you think that they need help. Because you're doing something bad to earth sign. But it's a how to get her into the hospital. Like when I said that, I get how to get Capricorn or sign energy, Virgo, whatever, or some or sign Taurus, get a guy, girl, whatever, or they're a part of it, or you ask them to be quiet, whatever it is, not working. 
how to get them into the hospital. Five of diamonds. How to get them into the hospital. Mm. Wow. All right, let's see what the outcome is. Oh, faith. But it workplace. Maybe you need faith to deal with the workplace. That's why I said, like, that's why I said five of diamonds. Someone's not returning to a school. I kind of see school as workplace as well. Somebody's not returning to like a workplace situation. Is it what happened to her or him? They were dragged. Whatever. They got into a car somewhere. Like, or they got into they somebody was tired of deception period, so they got into some random car. Right? with a strange somebody could have gotten into a car with a stranger, with a faith car. Be careful letting your friend or lover get into a car with a stranger. Coworker get in a car, some student get in your fellow student or somebody get into a car with a stranger. Don't let somebody get into a car with a stranger. It could be kids. A lot of cups here. But it's a why didn't her father come and pick her up? Like if you're dealing with kids, you're trying to understand why this this five of spades and eight of spades could be air. I get Gemini. You're dealing with a Gemini younger person. Why didn't her father come and pick her up? Or sign? Why? Why couldn't his him or her? Why couldn't their father come and pick them up? Hmm. Maybe they got into a car with a stranger, and something's going on with that. With the with the faith card energy here. Don't let your kids get into random cars without anybody, with the wrong person. Be careful with that. Or or your lover. But when I say lover, I, get, I should have treated her better. So so either somebody like somebody could have gotten into a car, like uh, could be an ambulance. I don't know. Someone could have gotten. I don't feel that too heavily. I just feel like somebody's trying to get somebody into a hospital, but I don't, not, whatever. There's a situation here where that's why I said cheating scenarios and secretive outings with somebody or sign interviews towards a Capricorn trying to get away from you. But some of the, I should have treated her better. Like maybe, maybe somebody is staying out late. Maybe somebody's staying out late a lot. Maybe your partner's staying out late a lot. And an Aquarian and 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 an Aquarian and some air like elements they saw or they have information into why somebody is staying out late a lot. Your Cancerian partner, your your Taurus housemate, family member, friend, or in Capricorn Earth sign energies that somebody's staying out late a lot. It's because of an Aries trying to get away from them. They're crazy, sadistic, and, and neurotic. It's because of them or they're trying to do something to somebody in a hospital setting with a faith card. Maybe it's, maybe it's a treatment on parents. Maybe you should have treated a parent better. Maybe something's going on with a parent or somebody's parent. Maybe somebody's parent was treated badly somewhere. But you have information into that. Or something's going on with cryptic messages. And, and, and maybe somebody's being cryptic with you. Somebody could be, maybe, maybe somebody's trying to be that way with you because they have more information into something's going on with you personally and they're not saying anything with a faith card. And it could have been the Aries. Mm. But I get Aries has information while, why your child's father is not showing up somewhere or why your child's father is I get, pretending to pretending to not want to see their child. Maybe you're the father, maybe you're trying to pretend like you don't want to see your kid or, or um, somebody's trying to pretend or make up scenarios into why they can't come and pick up their child, why they can't see their child. Hmm. Interesting. Huh. All right, Sag, let me know how it resonates with you. Be well, be blessed, take care. Bye.